So a little unscripted, impromptu video. I ordered this, the Arzopa monitor off of one of the TikTok shops. All these content creators raving about how great this portable secondary monitor is. So here it is, an unboxing, and I'll give my thoughts on it. No, well, the box looks nice. Something you'd get an iPad in, but that don't mean nothing if the monitor's crap. So let's see what's inside. Obviously, this is probably one of those Chinese knockoff things, so here's the monitor itself. We'll put that off to the side. Let's see what it comes with. Uh, a warranty card. So it has a 30 day refund policy and a 12 month warranty. Any problem you met when using the monitor, so anything, any issue with the monitor, it's 12 months. You have the privilege to extend the warranty for another 12 months. Here's a guide, eh. We have a USB-C to USB-C, USB-C to USB-A, cable, uh, purple, and what is that, an HDMI to mini HDMI? What is this guy, mean? mini HDMI port? Okay, so those are the three cables it comes with, put those back, so USB-C to USB-C, USB-C to USB-A, and what looks like HDMI to mini HDMI, not micro, so it's not going to work with uh, a Raspberry Pi without an adapter, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. All right, so let's get this open. And you'll have to forgive me, my camera's kinda in a weird spot for this, but it is what it is, right? Everybody raves, this thing's great. Let's see. So first impressions, the case is a faux leather. It feels cheap, but. Look at that. Not too bad on the size. For comparison, I'll get my 11 inch Samsung tablet. So it's significantly bigger. This is actually what I've been using as a second monitor, just placing right down here in case I needed one. This is a little bit bigger. So it claims to have 1080p, lightweight, USB C, ultra portable. Okay, cool. Here are the ports. So it looks like it has speakers here. Has there it connects with mini HDMI and it's the two USB C things, so I can connect this directly to my computer with just USB C on off volume up down. Looks like this does multiple controls. Let's see if there's anything on the other side. Okay, so nothing on the other side. It looks like it's got a let's take it out of the actual case. Look at the back of it. It's got one speaker here. That's it. It feels metal. It is, the frame is actually metal. Okay. Is it magnetic? Maybe? Well, the case itself is not winning any awards. It's just non-stick. There is metal, a magnetic backing here that connects it to the actual monitor. Huh. It looks like it just fits right in that groove. I would expect it to at least have metal. So we're going to set it up to my laptop using the USB-C to USB-C. Let's see if that registers it. Or is that just going to give it power? And unfortunately it's on the other side, so that's kind of stupid, but whatever. And Let's see how this works. Is this just going to power or are we actually going to get... No signal. Power saving. Okay.
It doesn't look like it has passed through. Probably should have read the user instruction guide, but it is what it is, right? So yeah, I selected to USB C. Is it just not doing it? Display settings. Showing a secondary monitor. Hey, some we do not recognize. All right, that might be because my work computer itself is locked down. So we're gonna unplug that. We're actually gonna try the USB to USB A. Plug it directly into my desktop. All right, folks, like I said, this is Improv 2 Unscripted. If this works, this would be kind of neat. I don't know if that's going to work. I may have to plug it directly in, but we'll see. in the hole. So this should be just plug and play. I'm pretty sure it is if I type it or if I put in the HDMI cable. Just get it up and running. You would think that USB C to USB C would have automatically work. It's probably like some driver or some BS I gotta download. Let's see. Blah 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 blah. Monitor, tech support. So it does say that USB C one supports power delivery and display port turn back on oh well it's on two am i just plugged into two available to plug this into probably not Let's see if it plugs into there Okay, well, it turns on. <laughs> Tablet mode. See if that will kick it off. It tech detected it was detected or connected to an external display. Ah, there we go. Dex. So that works. Okay, there you have it. It works. 
I'll give a further um, evaluation of its actual skills once I can figure out how to get to work with my computer correctly. But there you have it. Um, for I think I got it for 45 bucks. The build quality feels okay. I'm pretty sure it's going to do its job as a secondary monitor. But there you have it. There are Zopa portable monitor. Okay, so I got it working with use of the mini HDMI to HDMI. It seems like I couldn't really get the USB-C only to work as both power and display delivery. Um, my chassis actually doesn't have an external USB slot. Didn't realize that. But anyway, um, so I got it powered through USB-C. I know it will work because we saw it work with the tablet, but this is how I got it hooked up to my laptop. And as you can see, this is a 4K monitor. And that is definitely 1080p. But here is the sound quality of its one speaker. And this is actually at but, full volume. So, there it is. The Arzopa portable 1080p monitor. Um, like I said, I think I got this for 45 bucks. Uh, I paid more for less out of these portable monitors. I know they can get really expensive. Never understood why. So we'll see how this goes. Thanks.